and zero WAR in the shack here doing a little test video uh, pre mod. I swear to God, they don't teach anybody how to drive anymore. They just hand them out like that of a tracker jack button. It's K1TJ Thomas. And he's on the turbo. I'm going to disassemble the Go Box ham radio version 2.0. There's three boxes in there. There's like a 6U or an 8U. I don't know what that middle one is. It's on my other video. And then I got two smaller ones. So I'm going to order up from Amazon and mount on the wall back here somewhere a uh, wall mounted rack system so I wanted to do a video before I disassemble this there's a, a battery in the bottom and so it's running on emergency backup power and in here right now there's a couple of D710 Kenwoods Motorola XPR it's a UHF power supply uh, tuner battery and ICOM IC7100 right there. So I'm going to mount that on the wall back here and this is the test video before it gets disassembled. It's been an awesome go box turn into a go kart, a go box on a cart. There's casters on there and gear keeper hanger and going to uh, mount it up tomorrow so I'm going to start disassembling it right now but this is it it's a big one I had two big ones sold one to NZ0Z Tim and they're great it's the Gator Case Pro I forget how many use but it's going to free up a lot of space in the shack here this is N Zero W A R, a little ham radio video from Shutter Mafia Studios in the shack. And this is uh, part one. Blizzard, Loveland, Colorado, almost 20 inches already in the shack. Testing, emergency battery backup power. The new ham shack. Install on the wall. Got IC7100 tuner, two D710s, power supply, Moto Turbo XPR4550. That one's the UHF. Uh, Motorola handheld, Titera, and this is the new shack set up. Can't see anything on one of the tower cams at the moment, so watching the radar. And we got some activity on here. Eight U of rack space. There's a side view. Four U down here. Four U up here. In zero W A R. Aaron here doing another test video. Got super high ISO here, but hopefully you see it. New uh, ham radio shack set up. Got that Moto Turbo Kenwood D710 power supply, grounding bar, IC7100. Another uh, Kenwood and a tuner, which I use as a switch on the beam in the dipole, which just came down because of the blizzard. 
rotor, switch, controller. And that's it. Wanted to do another little update. Kind of see the side mount for you each. Side view. Sticks out like 12 inches, I think. Adding a little more of the test video. It's a phone. Surface Pro. Charging station. Got a uh, out of the back of the box charging strip that's rack mountable that's on there. And then I have another huge wall wart. Rat's nest. One more look at the box. You can use this for a closet mount, whatever. If you're a fire station or a hospital, and you need something to mount up that doesn't take any space that you can roll up a chair to and operate. I saw this at a wedding at the Estes Park. Colorado YMCA of the Rockies they had it set up for a sound system in the closet for uh, music and audio and it was way bigger than this so I looked it up and found these on Amazon for 30 bucks each and they are awesome so I disassembled the go box several of them and put everything in here on the wall mount it's awesome another look at it this way Oh, go ahead, N0 W A R. You need any help? North end of Long Mountain. You're hitting the repeater just fine. Okay, appreciate that. We've lost our cell phone and internet connections uh, up here in uh, at this park right now, so uh, we may be uh, on this channel. Well, feel free. Where you keep your time? Uh, and you probably know it already, but uh, our uh, net is at uh, early check-ins at six and regular at six thirty. So oh, no, 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 how much milk you got up there? I measured about 12 inches on my back deck, uh, but it's bright and clear now, and everything's starting to melt a little bit. Yeah, more snow in the front area up here this morning. The roads were pretty icy around uh, 10, 11 o'clock, but it's starting to clear up now. Oh, we got way more than that in Longmont. Uh, Cut in this line. Three and four feet deep. Uh, measurable snow. If I had to guess, I'd say two feet. Yeah, I saw it on the map, sir. It looks like south of here is getting hit pretty hard, north of here. Uh, fortunately, uh, as this park kind of sits here in a bowl in a valley here, and we get shielded uh, a little bit. We also uh, very really want to throw out numbers, considering this, to scare people or get people riled up and then it busts. But, you know, it's looking like we could get at least two to four as of right now. Um, uh, because 
the weather models, a couple of weather models there were conflicting or, or what was going on there. I, I don't Snow know. Link. Um, it, uh, the, the forecast, at least on the weather channel, was... Uh, one more look at the... Yeah, what happened was is something that computer models don't really pick up on. It's Ham radio shot, wall mount Low pressure in western Kansas. So it stalled for a good eight to nine hours, which is why the snow stayed here. And then we also have that barrier jet that formed when the cold front pushed through. So that only enhanced the snowfall amounts right here along I-25 corridor. So it was the combination of the two that forecast models don't really pick up on Delisa. that created all this. She's ham. She's in one of the Dow trucks, the radar trucks outside of town here. Yeah, Roger that. It uh, MJ. looks like the little They're trough turbo. there. Awesome. Kind of stayed put. And, and it's it, linked uh, uh, two meter and four forty DMR. High Terra, Brown Meister. Check it out. They, they, they modeled it. This is the emergency backup. Let's you check know, it with out. The next coming system, two of the models show a similar pattern as to what happened with this one. The other two show it being more progressive. There's a battery in, in that yeah, closet. Yeah, two of them are in agreement for stalling again. And then the other two have it just racing through. So now we're charging. Yeah, there's just and two commercial big power, power again. between the two sets of models right now to there's really a start riling up people for round two. For the battery. Right there. There's a switch for charging. And it automatically switches to battery backup. Rig runner. Yeah, very good. I, I follow all that. See, oh, I was going to ask you, um, one of the meteorologists there in Boulder, uh, he signs his uh, discussion as a uh, guard. Uh, I haven't seen any of his uh, discussions for a long time. You, you know what I'm talking about? Let's see who they're talking about. Yeah, I know the name. Uh, I haven't seen him in a while either. Uh, he may have transferred offices or positions there within the same office. Um, people do get promoted or, you know, change to a different office every so often or, you know, just change roles. You know, they may leave from forecasting and go to, say, hydrology or avalanche or something. So there's always things changing in there that I honestly don't know personally what specifically his deal is, but that would be my idea. Okay, yeah, I, uh, I, uh, re I really miss reading his volunteers get some check-ins. Uh, let's see what we can drum up for folks and make sure that they understand this is a standby situation at the moment only because we haven't actually been activated, but we're just trying to line ducks up. Okay, now I can't monitor, well, I can go downstairs and, and monitor, but I didn't know if I needed to do that, uh, monitor multiple places right at this point in time. No, you shouldn't need to, um, because uh, Estes can call in on 275. I'll keep a radio on that uh, all the time uh, until you get some folks scheduled. And if you could give me your schedule as it develops, that would be terrific. Uh, but yeah, otherwise, I'll take care of monitoring initially on the 275 if you will take care of requesting resources on a volunteer, on standby sort of basis. Good. So take down these call signs and availability, and we'll go from there. Okay. You uh, you want people to just stay tuned down there? Then is that the pro is that the situation right now? Correct. Yeah. Have a monitor the one one five. Availability. 